Welcome back to Cold Plays. We're playing Until Dawn. I'm Gwen Spire. I'm Cole Spire. And we're here to make some bad choices. <laughs> and piss off deer, apparently. <laughs> Although I kind of am afraid of the deer. Well, it is a pack of wild deer that are pushing you up against the back of a cliff. I'd be afraid of them, too. Yeah. But before we get into that, we last left off with... Um, Hayden Penitieri walking around in nothing but a towel, being stupid. Well, I, Sam being stupid. Yeah, I was going to say voiced by Hayden. Well, practically looks exactly like Hayden Penitieri. But running around uh, with headphones on in the creepy, creepy, no lit up place. Well, she was well, bathing with the headphones on and she got out and now she's in a towel. And her backpack was stolen by the creepy dude. I, I still think it would be better if she was without the towel, but that's just me. All right, let's check on some of our statuses and stuff. Current objective, search for your friends. No shit. Uh, we got a new clue because we found Beth's phone last time. Beth never went anywhere without her cell phone. She must have passed this way on the night of the disappearance. She did. She fell off the fucking cliff. The same cliff the deer are trying to push us off of. Uh, found oh. the picture of the miners. Frame photo of a group of miners rescued after a cave-in, dated 1952. The plaque says all the 12, mon 12 miners survived. But they didn't, because they ate people. Updated axe holder. We found the axe. Remember, that was missing. We yeah. found the axe uh, at the cable car station. The cigar. So this is the same guy that lives in the sanatorium that had the cigar there. Yeah. Okay. And the new one, the scar box. A wooden scar box, only a single scar is left. It has a distinctive brand label. Oh, uh, the wall it? clippings, a map of the mountain with sightings and recent disappearances marked with dates. It looks like the work of an obsessive mind. And then the axe in the door. Axe stuck in the door of the cable car station. It definitely wasn't there before. No shit, because we all left or walked out there. We found a bunch of totems. No kidding. Two black ones, cause, cause reasons. Mike trying to blow himself up. Yeah, yeah. Don't, don't. Uh, smoking's bad. And we found this one, which is Matt, dying. Matt falling off the cliff, which I have a feeling has to deal with the deer. All the bucks with the giant antlers. All right, yellow's guidance. This is the flare gun at the ranger station, the fire the fire station. That we need to find. And then we found a white one. We have not found a lot of red ones. We've only found one. Um, and this was... Getting back to the getting lodge? Getting back into the lodge with Ashley and... What's his name? Uh, Chris? Chris. Ashley and Chris. Yeah. Alright. Oh. Here we go. Man's, Man's best, best friend. friend. So, Mike didn't kick the wolf. Mike made a friend. Aww. So sweet. Aww. And then on the same page, Matt resisted Emily's plan to go to the fire tower. And yet we're somehow still going. <laughs> we didn't get anything from whose side are you on? Huh. I guess we didn't have to make a choice. I guess. <gasps> it might be because uh, Jess is dead. Oh. All right. Here we go. All right. All right. Sam in the towel. Makes my day. Oh, for Pete's sakes, my clothes, really? Whichever one of you did this is... And you get to see her in a towel a little longer, apparently. Not cool, guys. Not cool at all. That's a sock. You can wear socks. I'm cool with you just wearing a sock. Nothing but socks. Is there anything else? You know, if you look around there, Sam, I'm sure you can find where the camera is that watched you get undressed. Just saying. That's the sock still. Okay. Chris? Oh. Gosh. 
That's a. That's, that's a balloon, a balloon. with an arrow on it. That's who the guy reminds. It reminds me of a really, really, really creepy Pennywise. Like huh. even creepier than Pennywise was in the original It movie, but like creepy Pennywise, creepy. Locked. Not locked. What's in there? Uh, I feel underdressed for this occasion. <laughs> I feel very underdressed for this occasion. Like oh, fuck me. <laughs> Was there anything back there? Because I feel like this is where he wants us to go because I see another balloon. No, I'm, well, I wanted to check this, so I'm going to go back. I didn't see anything. Instead, we got jump scared by... Oh, I can't go back. Oh, oh wait, yeah, okay. I can. Like I said, I feel underdressed for this occasion. See, the balloon is pointing that way, so that's the way I was supposed to go. Oh, yeah, something. Or is this back to the bathroom? Nope, locked. So not the bathroom. I just She's got to be else. freezing her tits off. Well, the cabin I don't think is heated, so apparently there is nothing else. <sighs> w on the panel. Oh, this camera angle sucks. That's the door we tried to go through that we can't go through. They're like, do you like legs? We'll show you legs. Lots of legs. She's not going to say anything about the balloon. Okay. Don't say anything about the balloon. Fine. I'm just gonna let that let that hang in the air there. Okay, so it's telling me to go that way. So I'm Chris, gonna go this way. Mike, Emily. Because there's something. This is really what? getting out of hand. Okay, it was all very funny. Ha ha. Look at Sam walking around in a towel. But a film now I just really want this to be over. All right. Horror film. You had enough. What does it say? Horror film. Director Bob Washington. Isn't that like uh, Beth's last name too? It's like her parents or something? I guess. Can I have my clothes back now or am I supposed to hang out in a towel for the rest of the weekend? I'm okay with you in a towel for the rest of the weekend. Okay. Nope. Yes, I see the giant balloon. Where did he get the helium? Maybe it was in the basement? <laughs> Seems to be a lot of shit in the basement. Apparently. Like, I can't say that she would hear him feel, filling up the balloons because she's had her headphones in while she's been naked in the dark freaking cabin that has people disappearing. I feel like we should be listening to uh, I want to do bad things to you. Oh, the music just got creepy. Okay, it's this picture again. We saw that already. <laughs> There's a post there. <laughs> Sorry, I'm paying attention to stuff in the background because of the dude that was in the mine before, remember? Yeah. Ooh. Can we go through that? Why do I have a feeling if we go that way, we're going to die? Locked. Apparently they're making it so we can't go this way. Locked. That's a amazing animation that sh everybody checks the door the exact same way three different times. Four times. Oh. Trust me, you don't want to go outside dressed as you are anyway. It would be bad for you. 
But if you don't want to follow the creepy balloons and you want to get the hell out of Dodge, apparently you're fucked. Wow, that zoomed up really fast on her. I don't like that. Yeah, guess what? You succeeded. Good, if you're trying to freak out the player, it worked too. Anything else? I don't I think don't so. see anything. Quit stalling, just go downstairs. I don't want to go downstairs. It's going to be bad. You have made circles. <laughs> it's bad. Bad things that happen to the people who go downstairs. It's a three-story cabin? Jesus. Well, they were rich. A <sighs> cinema room. Are you guys? So. Wow, this is weird. Oh. Uh. Hey, guys, come on! Oh, I'm done with this. I really don't appreciate the silent treatment here. Oh, come on. Hello, Samantha. <laughs> His name is Psycho. Looking for me? No. I, don't I was looking for my clothes. I'm looking, Samantha. You're only going to see what I want you to see. And I have quite a lot to show you. What is going on? Open your eyes. Oh my god. She's quite beautiful, isn't she? What are you doing out there? A beautiful bathing bird. Do you think she has any idea what lies ahead? Do you think these were the last happy moments of this creature's Why life? Showing this to me. Why are you watching? Josh! How does it make you feel? <laughs> what did you do? I'm going to give you ten seconds. Nine. No, eight, no, 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 no. Seven. Run, uh, run, run! Run! Run, bitch, run! Oh my god. Um, jump. That was close. You broke your fucking ankle. Uh, hide or run, hide or run. Run. He's lugging around helium. Oh, that's. Are you kidding me? No handle? Pull or force? Pull. You're gonna descend your... Alright. That didn't... Oh. Oh, there's the handle. She's not gonna get it in time. Get it! Get it! Oh. 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 That was close. You better fucking go for it. Walk faster, walk faster, must walk faster. And it's locked. Uh, the door. Oh. oh! Ow! Oh, that. What? Apparently they had a secret underground place that's been long. Hide or run, hide or run. Hide? I don't, I don't oh, know where you are, so. Fuck. Oh, oh, this is not good. Oh, shit. <laughs> not moving, not moving, I'm not moving. Oh, 
You hid! Who? <laughs> I could see the little light bar inching right and right and right. I'm like, no, I'm not fucking moving! No, it didn't go according to plan. What? Yet in a crucial moment, you are foiled by your own inadequacies. Hey! Everything you do has consequences. Do you think this mistake... Why is the office back to not I don't know. What do you do and what you say causes things to change? Yes. And the music. All the good work we did exploring the source of your fear. And you've just gone and used it for ill. Mm -hmm. Your overwhelming fear of isolation. You have turned it against these people who you so desperately want to torment. Has it been worth it? Has it been worth it? That creepy fucking photo. Ah! Ah! What? Psychosis. Okay. I am not gonna do shit. I'm. They're deer. Calm, calm, calm. Stay calm. Relax. They're just deer. They're just deer. They're just deer, they're just deer with giant horns. No, 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 Matt. They're gonna hurt us. Shut up, bitch. Okay, okay, keep going, guys. That's cool. Moses in the Red Sea. Just, just keep parting. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. Oh, and there's gonna be one that's not gonna move. Oh, look! It was the other guy that ripped the dude's head off. Wasn't me. It was not me. Just walk slow. It's okay. Come on. It's okay. See? See? It wasn't me. I'm out! I'm out! I'm out, bitch! Run! What is wrong with you? Run! I totally did sure. I would too! She's a bitch! <laughs> oh, now he's helping her. And Matt lives. And Matt lives. Oh, we're in control of uh, Emily, well, Emily now. We have passed the Nature Guardian's test. <laughs> We are now one with nature. Okay, Hanzo. Hey, Reaper was already in here. If we do manage to get someone on <laughs> and the radio, his couson room, creepy then it clown. We need help. What do we do while we wait? We go back to the lodge and get everyone else. Oh god, not the lodge. We should stay here in case whoever it is needs to get back in touch with us. Let's get that radio working first. Let's see if you're saying. I see stairs. I do see stairs. And a tower. And the tower. And a flashing red light, which doesn't really mean that there's electricity. Uh, that means that there's electricity. Freaking bright! No kidding. I can't see. What is that? It's just a security light. Motion sensor, probably. Motion sensor. Why would it be on a motion sensor, though? Wouldn't it go off every single time an animal came near? Is that a hammock? Can you just chill in the hammock? Until this is all... No, that's a wavy thing. It's like, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> I would just chill in the hammock and be like, look, we're done. There's killers arrive, but I'm gonna chill in the hammock. Hey. The hammock is the safest place you could be. Right in the hammock. So the, this is rickety. I don't think anyone's been out here in a very long time. Kind of makes you nervous to go to the top, doesn't it? Wouldn't matter, because I wouldn't be out here in the first place. <laughs> so I don't have to climb the fire tower. And you're just gonna you're just gonna stay down there? You you can you can join me? You got the axe. You gonna you're just gonna stay down there. Or leave the, that was stupid. Really? He climbed down the ladder 
from the the lodge with the axe, but he's just gonna leave the axe there. Matt, I wanna like you, but you're a dumbass. <laughs> Why is it so windy all of a sudden? I thought you were supposed to be we're a smart jock. Why is it so windy all of a sudden? Because we're on top of a mountain on a very rickety old tower. That's, that's why. There's nothing up here except... Oh, no. Is that something? No, nope, that's the ladder. Okay. Oh, stop! Climbing. And she gets sucked up into nothingness. I was gonna say, for, for once, I'd be okay with that. Oh, uh, come on, there's something in the locker. There's gotta be something in the locker. Oh, uh, there's gonna be someone below it. Right. We're not gonna see it. And he closes it! Yay! Somebody at closed least the door! Did something, at least he did something smart. <laughs> by leaving the axe to yeah. down at the bottom. For them to chop down the door. For them to, yeah, chop open the door. You really want to check that locker, don't you? I do. Hey, it's Hannah. Sorry, Hannah. You're still missing. After tonight, their disappearance is starting to make more sense. You think? Shouldn't there be, like, supplies or some shit around here? A radio. There's a radio. What is this? A printer? So, no power. <sighs> oh, come on. No power. Great. No power. Why are the cute ones always so yes. dumb? There's something around here. It's coming from outside. Almost there. Damn it. Leave your ass. Yep. Oh, look, there's a switch. I wish I could control the camera. I can't. Yes, I know, I saw the switch and stuff. Ha ha! I knew it! Remember, we were supposed to look for the flare. Yep. Flare gun. Here we go. Oh, it gave it to him, right? Yeah, gave it to him. Okay. You take this, might need it. Point it at him, though, you know. It did show that it, we were supposed to give it to him. Yeah. Okay. okay. Now we do the switch. Yay! Now we can check what's on the printer. Hey, score one for Matt and Emily. I'm gonna check the printer first. This is gonna be bad. Oh, there's more. Sorry, you're still missing too, Beth. She dead. She ain't missing. I'm doing that. There we go. Contact us. This is the Park Ranger Service for Blackwood County. We're not getting your signal very well. 
please, please, please help. Oh my god, we're stuck on Blackwood now. Because that's slowly and clearly. <laughs> Until dawn. Credits! Jesus! Oh my god, he's scared! He's coming for me! Well, that's no bueno. And you left the axe at the bottom. That's not good. That's not good. Oh, and a fire. Why not? Wow. Oh. Oh. I was gonna. She dead? She gotta be dead, right? <laughs> she dead. Damn it! What are you waiting for? I mean, Not I mean, dying? Don't you know. Freak, you idiot. Just get me out of here. Supportive or suspicious? No, no, no. We're not gonna accuse her of saying I saw you with Mike when she's about to die. That's that's Emily, fucked up. That's kind of <laughs> fucked. That's like saying I might let you die if you say the wrong thing. <laughs> Stop yelling at me and let me work this out, okay? No, you stop it! Why do you question every little thing I say? I'm goddamn sick of it! Oh, I want to be a bitch, but I'm not going to. I'm going to be uh, concerned. I'm going to be, I'm going to be I'm concerned. I'm going to try and get to you and pull you up. Now, will you please get me off this goddamn tower? Please, 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 Matt, just do it! Because if they both survive, I can guarantee she's going to die alone with, like, 50 cats. I'm coming. Here. Ah! Shit. Oh shit. God damn it, bitch. Can't you hold on for two seconds? Jesus Christ. I don't want to tip it. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have to jump. I'm jump. Oops. Well, I wouldn't let you save her. You guys Emily. are both gonna die.
So is there no way to save her? Like, if I tried to save her again, would it have killed... What It would have killed us both, right? Yeah, I think it would have killed you both, because he was saying, I don't want to tip it. And it was making it seem like... She wasn't up there? I don't know, I didn't see her. She must have come down here. I haven't seen her either. And unfortunately, we're going to have to wait to see her. Because that is all the time we have, folks. Um, it didn't show her die. Like, it's it's been very unapologetic about watching people die. Yeah. I'm saying she's still alive. I'm thinking so, too, because we, we almost thought she had died falling with the tower, and she didn't die. I think she's really hurt, but I don't think she's dead. I think we're going to come back to her. God, this game. And then the creepy skeletal mask clown thing. Anyway, that's all the time we have for this episode, folks. I hope you join us for the next one. Hopefully I can get Gwen to join me again and make some bad decisions, even though I kind of jumped the gun on a couple of them. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you for joining us. If you'd like to follow me on any of the social medias, all the links are down below. So this has been Cole Plays. This is Until Dawn. My name is Cole Spire, and I've been joined by... Gwen Spire. And we hope to see you guys next time. <laughs>